welcome or welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is renee welcome to a vlog miss day 18. today's just gonna be a chill day well i don't know i'm gonna i'm getting ready to go to the gym of course and then we'll have a few errands that i need to run i need to drop off um a package at the post office and i think some other little household things and then i need to come home clean and yeah one thing i'm gonna do today is i'm gonna play with blending fragrance oils for my rebrand so that's exciting um yeah so right now i'm just gonna eat something really quick mix my pre-workout and my creatine and head on out hey guys i am back home now we just went to the gym like i said had a great uh hamstring and glute workout unfortunately i couldn't form film anything in there because it was kind of busy then we went to the grocery store i dropped off my package and i ate now i'm gonna clean i need to sweep mop clean my bathroom all of that all the good stuff i usually do my cleaning on saturdays i know people do sunday resets saturdays are for me so i'm gonna clean and then after that i'm gonna take a shower and i'm gonna start playing with some fragrance oils to see if i can get some blends so yeah let's go clean. From eight until late, I think about you. You're on my nights, I don't know what to do. do. I can't get no rest, can't get no sleep. Yeah. This whole thing got way too deep in the Now I am done cleaning. I took a shower. Here we are. I haven't done my full skincare routine yet. I'm going to do it when I'm done everything, like before I'm ready to go to bed. Um, But now we're going to start playing with some fragrance oils so these are the fragrance oils that i have i have a few more in this drawer down here but i'm gonna start picking out a few to see which ones that i want to try to make um different blends with okay you guys so these are a few of the fragrance oils i'm gonna play with today and there's some essential oils in here too but first things this one love potion from kendra soap is sticking out to me because it is on my fingers after taking a nap. So this one is a, a blend of white jasmine, ylang ylang, rose petals, citrus peel, neroli flower, geranium, and musk. And it smells really good. It's like a, it's a soft scent. Like, I don't know how to smell it, but it kind of smells powdery to me as well. Mm. Actually, it reminds me of this uh, lotion my mom used to wear. Um, so I don't know what I want to mix with this. I'm gonna look through these and then see what stands out to me. And then I have, I don't know why I brought frosted juniper, birch and juniper, but I was thinking maybe with the ice cucumber. I'm I'm really playing with different oils right now. Like this is just like really random. And I was thinking maybe the two together. What do I think? Okay, so that is one. And then I have clove and I have frankincense and I have some other um, essential oils I don't know what blends well with that so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna look up on Google what blends uh, well with clove and frankincense frankincense is like the king of essential oils for your skin I had bought this when I made a facial oil and it was just it was so good but I stopped making that facial oil so I'm gonna see what I can blend with this so frankincense clove will blend well with wild orange cedarwood ginger and cinnamon because they're warm aromatic characteristics so I only have sweet orange so I don't think that would go well with it frankincense actually blends well with lavender orange grapefruit lemon geranium ylang ylang and clary sage so it might be good Ooh, either these two or frankincense with love potion i don't know let me keep these together and then i can grab my um orange grapefruit lemon and geranium essential oils so my goal is warm bold scents like nothing fruity nothing bakery but it's funny because i used to be a person who would get like bakery scents like i bought this candle from bath and body works a while back and the other day i went to light it and i literally felt sick to my stomach i had to like just blow it out it was disgusting to me so we're not doing that anymore and i'm not going for anything fruity because 
the new re the rebrand of this business is just gonna be like bold warm sultry sexy like that's the, the thing i'm going for so i want like those kind of warm scents so i'm just trying to see what i can do with what i have here the only thing is i don't have um i don't have any pipettes and i'm gonna try to mix them in these little beakers and see if this works for me so the first one i want to do is i'm gonna pour a little bit of love potion because i like that i like the way it smells i just want to bring out something warm in it there's musk there's geranium like it, it's a lot of like floral scents but i'm gonna see if i can bring it out with the or if i can bring out some more warm scents with the frankincense if that makes sense let's see It'll just be easier since i don't have pipettes i need to order some just make sure it's a zero i'm gonna only do a little amounts and i made like these like blotter sheets out of cardstock <laughs> okay so i'm gonna do one part of this so one gram of that you guys it actually smells good the first time i got it i was like eh i was supposed to release this a while back i never did let me see what the cold smells like it smells woodsy but then i knew that so let's try the frankincense I'm gonna do one part frankincense as well. Or should I do half? Can't really smell it. I know that kind of smells good, but like I still get more love potion over the frankincense. I don't know how I feel about that. The more I smell it, the more I like it. I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna try to add a little bit of clove to see if I can cut that like powdery scent that I smell. Oh, that completely changed that. It had gave it more of a smoky smell. I don't know how I feel about that. It's, it smells okay. Not exactly what I was going for. So I'm going to write down on each side what they are so I don't forget. And then we're going to try another blend. Okay, so that's those two blends. Let's move on. No, I have a little oatmeal milk and honey, which smells good all on its own. I have some vanilla. I know I need to order fragrance oils because I don't know... I don't have a lot to play with really so let's see here. lily of the valley is like a floral scent which i don't really care too tough for okay let's try one gram oatmeal milk and honey and then one gram of vanilla So ultimately honey is notes of raw honey, tonka bean, whipped vanilla cream, and almond milk. So it already has vanilla. So I'm going to see if this brings out a little bit more of a vanilla smell. So I went ahead. It smells good, but it didn't bring out too much vanilla. And then I went two grams of vanilla and one oat milk and honey. And still, it's, it's still closer to oat milk and honey smell. So that's that one. Um... I don't really care for it. Ultimate and Honey smells okay, but it's not the scent that I'm going for. I'm going to try a fresh scent because I obviously have to have one that's just like real fresh, you know? So I'm going to mix it in this back one thing because I ran out of uh, beakers that are clean. Um, I have Saltwater Mermaid. I have Ice Cucumber. Sorry, Cool Cucumber. I have Ice Cucumber. I have Frosted Birch and juniper and i have jasmine and seaside i think i want to try jasmine and seaside with salt water i can't speak salt water mermaid so i'm going to do half and half yeah 
You know what? Let's do 50-50 because I'm making too much. So we're just going to go up 0.5 grams. And then we're going to use this Jasmine and Seaside Breeze. It this smells so good. It's, it's fresh. Like, it's the definition of fresh. <laughs> so... Ooh, that smells good. Ooh. I love that. Oh my god, I love that. That smells so good. <laughs> Saltwater Mermaid is a fresh, watery green fragrance combining notes of ocean mist and seagrass with agave nectar and coconut milk. And that smells heavenly. And then Jasmine and Seaside Breeze is a blend of coconut water, clementine peel, nectarine, with middle notes of beach jasmine, vanilla orchid, and sugar cane. It also has in base notes of amber, sun-kissed sand, and a hint of exotic musk. And it does smell like a seaside vacation in a bottle. So the two of them together just come like really complements each other. Now I'm going to be a little extra and I'm going to add in a little bit of ice cucumber, I think. Ice cucumber is like really crisp. I can give you the notes for that one too. That has top notes of ice cucumber, dew drops, middle notes of water lotus, jasmine petals, and bottom notes of cashmere musk and amber woods. So I'm also going to go with 0.5 grams of that. So they're all equal parts. I gotta get pipettes. This is ghetto. Let us see. Let us see. Oh, that ice cucumber is a lot stronger, so it takes it over. Oh, that smells good. I don't know. I'll have to decide. Okay, I, th I think I'm gonna try one more blend just because I'm enjoying this. This is the Forever Red. It's like the Bath and Body Works dupe. I'm going to go with one part of that. I'm going to try it with the Love Potion. Oops. I went a little bit over. Let's see how that smells though. Yeah, no, I can't do it. <laughs> Love Potion is a no-go for me. Yeah, that's it. None of those really screamed, I need to have it. So I'm going to order some more fragrance oils. I'm probably not going to do it today, but I know I need to order different fragrance oils to get the, the blends in the sense that I want. I'm done that. I did about like six, seven uh, combos. But yeah, I'm done with all of that. I'm going to go make some cookies. <laughs> Okay, you guys, that is going to be all for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm just going to eat cookies and watch Avatar, the first one, because I'm going to watch the second one tomorrow. And um, I just want to rewatch this one first. So that's all I'll be doing for the rest of the evening. And then I'm going to edit this video. So I want to thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.